Good morning. Hello. Hi. <laughs> We're at uh, Paradise Country this morning. Going to have a look around. Haven't been here before. Going to. You're on. Yeah, because my skirt's blowing off in the wind. I never learn. I never ever learn to wear shorts underneath. <laughs> yes, hopefully this will be a nice, pleasant day. Um, playing with animals, playing with the birds, looking for opals, striking I've heard it rich. There's dingoes, and that's all I care about. There better be churros. That's what. I, that's all I got to say. I feel like this isn't the place uh, for churros. <laughs> Anyhow, let's go and have a look. First up, we're going into the animal nursery. I just got to look out for old Ned over there. Here come the goats oh, and the sheep. I wonder if we're supposed to walk. No, I don't think we're supposed to walk up there. We'll go around the side. These tiny little guinea pigs. I don't know if we're allowed to lean over and pat Probably them. Probably not them. But look, if you can read there. Peaches. You've got so Slinky, cute. Pocahontas, Ariel, Woody, Buzz, Peaches, Daisy. Hold on. Hang on. Oh, Hang on a minute there. <laughs> look at look at this one. This is oh going. My oh God, is... look at me. <laughs> Come and pat me. There's a few sheep and goats at the back here. There's some food here that you can pick up if you want to. Give them something to eat. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I don't think he's interested in being padded, he just wants food. Look at his little horns. Oh no! Just put your hand over. Hello, goat. Hello, goat. Hello, goat. On the way out, I need to go find out the name of that adorable cow. Calf? Calf? Is that what you call baby cows? Calf. Calf. Hi. Whoa, whoa. Yes, hello. Have a look where the sheep have, have just completely ring bark the tree. Well, I assume it's the sheep. This goat's got a goatee. <laughs> Let's have a look. Oh, he's not happy. He's not happy. Show she beard, mate. Let's have a look at your beard. What a ripper. Hey, look at it. I'm so stupid. I went to go wash my hands and I was like bending over on the kids, the kids like hand washing thing, the like lower, the lower sink, not realizing that it was for kids. And there was actually one where I could have stood up and washed my hands. Have a look at the peacocks. Just chillaxing up there where no one can reach them. And then we got the kangaroos. I need little ones. I'm gonna, I'm gonna touch. No. No. Did you not read the sign? It said, do not disturb sleeping. He's not asleep, is he? No. He's not asleep. It's so soft, Alex. That's all they do. Sleep. For God, I, I can't remember how long it is, but it's a lot of hours out of the day that they sleep for. Alex just read the sign and it's 18 to 20 hours a day that they sleep for. They're pretty soft, aren't they? Yeah, I was going to say. Here's the emus. Big ass bird it is. This goat is not meant to be in here. He was next door, but he's pushed his way through the fence. Eating all their food. What's the emu doing? Going to hit the goat. Get out, goat. Look out, goat. Oh my God. Look out, goat. You're going to cop it. Oh no. Maybe the emu no. just wants food, you know. Oh my God, I'm kind of scared. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not touching him either. 
Oh, I don't know if you can see it through the... Stick the camera over there. Have a look at him. He's sitting down, just looking at us. He's actually a small one, but he's not very big. We're going into the uh, nocturnal exhibit, which is dark. Sorry. And I know my phone sucks in the dark. So there well, might, we'll see. <laughs> mightn't be anything in here that we can show. Never mind, there was, there was nothing in there, at least that we could see. Maybe because it was daytime, they just like were hiding out somewhere. <laughs> could be, could be. Can't even find the uh, Tasmanian devil. Must be sleeping somewhere. You can buy a lot of uh, stuffed toys in the gift shop. Um, a lot of Sean the Sheep merch. A peacock. What's that? Just a peacock. You can read the prices. Three for fifteen dollars or seven bucks each for for the smaller ones. Bigger ones. Twenty two dollars each. Oh, two for 30 for the koala or the sheep. Oh, they're the pillow pets, Aussie pillow pets. Uh, you can also buy food in here for the kangaroos. Yeah, I was looking for that. And I'm looking for the price, but I can't see it anywhere. Wildlife, $2. Two dollars. $2 for a bag. We're on the hunt and they're up this way. There goes Alex, she's running for them. Watch out for the big kookaburra, Alex. He might swoop you. They have what they call farm stay here, um, where you can stay overnight, sit around a campfire. Not 100% sure where that is. Could be out the back over there. They've got like um, tents, per permanent tent sort of thing set up. Um, I'll do a bit more investigation into that and leave some prices maybe on the bottom of the screen now while we're looking for dingoes. We found one dingo and you're probably not going to see it. He's, he's lying on his bed in the little, little hut down here. Oh, there he is. He's rolling over. Surely there'd be more than just one, you would think. Sir, so I just like wasn't aware that dingoes came in different colors. I thought they were all this like orangey color. Like if I saw a dingo out in the middle of nowhere looking like this, I would just think that it's a regular dog. This says Sean's Adventure Camp. I'm not really 100% sure what it is. You can, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you're meant to do in here. Maybe just sit down and watch TV. So I'm fairly confident now that that's what you can stay in overnight. They actually don't, don't look too bad. It'd be nice and cool in there, but um, I don't know how much it is. It's not currently on right now because it's not 12.30 yet, but um, they do pony rides here for kids. Um, I would, I feel like I would do that if I was of age, but um, I don't think they're gonna, they're gonna let me do that. But it is $5 a child if you wanted to do that. Who are you going to call, Alex? Ghostbusters. Is anyone there? No. 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 I'm calling the home <laughs> <laughs> Not that anybody answers our home uh, You can do um, bird feeding here, feeding the lorikeets, which is uh, a very peak of interest for Dad. However, um, I am almost deathly afraid of birds and I can tell you that I will not be going in with dad so if you want to film a little like selfie angle when you do it you can do that. So you can buy some uh, dirt at the um, at the homestead gift shop which is just behind this um, and you can come here and pan it and try and find some gold and and other gemstones. It's a nice playground there for kids as well. Swings and slides and climbing things. Swing around this way, the restaurants here. Oh, the restaurants here. We're, we're going to have a look. Let's go and have a look, shall we? I think um, the 
this would be like a really nice place to stay to like get away from the city for a bit. I'm very much a city person, so I would like never do that, but. <laughs> you could do gold panning. Just having a look at this sign. So it says, farmhouse restaurant, which we're gonna have a look at in a second, homestead, uh, Billy T, campfire, stock horse arena, gold panning, opal mining, dingoes, lorikeets, yeah, there's a, there's a fair bit here, but it's pretty small. The uh, menu is on the table. Vegetarian burger, 16 bucks. What's that for $17? Is a grilled chicken burger. Beef burger, 17 It looks like there must be a buffet here. Um, barbecue. Here we go. Country burgers family tray of chips for 10 bucks your mother would like that <laughs> and then over this side is all the all the drinks oh they got pies Alex sausage rolls wine slushies there's your soft drink prices five bucks for a coke 450 wow, for water cool. but only three three bucks for alcohol they are pie and drink ten dollars, roll and drink nine bucks. Look how good these muffins look. Oh, oh my goodness, look at those. I might have to get one of those look before at we the leave. Triple chuck one. Oh, that looks so good. I'm thinking the raspberry and white chocolate. I mean that is the flavour I would go for, but the triple chop just looks really appetizing. Let's see if this is as tastes as good as it looks. Cut it in half. Cut it in half. Let's go. Even the inside looks really good. Like it's not one of those muffins that just like has the things on top. It's like all through the middle. Mm. That's nice. Mm. The raspberry flavor is really good. Yeah. The raspberry is like a really good amount of like Mm. Would definitely recommend the muffins here. <laughs> Found the marmoset that it's in the um, restaurant. The enclosure, well, the enclosure's not in the restaurant, but the windows where you can see them are in the restaurant. Tiny little things they are. Here comes the lady with the food, and I'm sure she's about to be attacked. by about 3,000 lorikeets. Oh, here they come. Have to get in the shade. So you can see it properly. There's the Suki Lala, sitting there, too afraid of the birds, didn't want to come down. And stop, stop, stop. There was actually more than one dingo in here. There's one down here. And the, the one's still up sleeping in the little um, hut. You know how um, Disney princesses have like outrageously weird animal like companions? If I was a Disney princess, I'd want to have a dingo companion. <laughs> this is good when you're standing behind me. All right, I'll stay here then. I'll talk louder. All right, that was a look at Paradise Country. It's included in your Village, village Roadshow, Roadshow Pass. One pass. Yeah. Um, I had I had a it better was, time than I thought I was gonna have. Yeah, um, it's better than what I thought. Yeah, when I looked online and saw that it was like just a bunch of animals, like. I didn't really think much of it, but um, turns out I do love a good, cute animal. <laughs> they were so cute. We learnt the name of that cow. Um, Johnny? Calf. Johnny? Cat. Calf. <laughs> Johnny. Johnny. So cute. So cute. Yeah, so I, I don't know how much prices are if you want to come here just for like the day. Like for one day, yeah. Um, I probably wouldn't do that because no, there's not a lot. Yeah. 
but it was like a good nice inclusion for um the like movie world pass. yeah it's something different nice it, it's a nice relaxing time yeah i think staying here would be a nice idea too yeah we'll look at the prices of that um they said at the reception that you can like bring your own bring your own tent, tent to stay here bring your own oh, I could it's bring starting the camp. to rain you could bring the camper trailer alex and we could just camp here here <laughs> all right that's it from us yeah thank you for watching thanks for watching see you next week unless the coronavirus locks us out of theme parks we can do a a Home day in our ball. day in our life what you can't say that <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> All right, stop. Hero, bye.